Hey guys, so we're focusing on fit, keeping fit, and not just through um, the heart and what you do with exercise, but also what are you nourishing your body with so that it can do the exercise for you. So um, this is a recipe that I have adapted from Honestly Healthy. Um, as you know from watching the videos that I put up, for me it's all about really quick. What can I, what can I make that's quick? And this is really quick. You can use it as, a, you don't know what it is, yeah, do you? Um, you can use it as a pudding or you can use it as a breakfast. So we're gonna start off with some chai seeds. So again, as you know, I don't particularly measure things out, but um, it's around that much. Does that help you? No, I don't know, but anyway. And then we're gonna put a whole glass of um, cashew milk in. Now you can make your own cashew milk, but I am using Rude Health here, because again, it is, um, this is kind of all about finding something that's quick and nutritious. So the chai seeds are an amazing source of omega-3 and fiber, and the benefits are boosting energy, which is why it's part of my, you can just see Rocket's little tail there, <laughs> why it's part of my winter um, booster, um, part of my winter diet. Hello, Rocket, yes. And also it can help lower your blood sugar, and uh, there are other benefits to it as well. And then we're gonna add a little bit of agave syrup. So this is a, oh, I've got a spoon now. Uh, this is something that you can use as an alternative to honey, maple syrup. Um, so there's lots of companies out there that offer this. Um, so you've got your agave syrup. And then I'm going to actually add in some raw, um, blueberries. So great source of antioxidant. Um, there's always one that gets away. Uh, so we're adding those in. And um, if you've ever cooked with chai seeds before, um, you need quite a lot of liquid compared to the seeds themselves because they start to expand. Um, and then we're gonna go, you can put in any superfood you want. Um, I'll, um, I've got um, a side powder here. So I'm just gonna add in this lovely, amazing purple um, super food there and give it a good old mix up and uh, potentially with a fork might be a little bit better um, and then you put it in the fridge for six hours so if you want it as a, um, as a pudding obviously make it in the morning uh, but I'm making it in the evening for my breakfast tomorrow and uh, look we're coming up with that lovely purple colour and uh, yeah, let's see, let's see how it tastes. It's all about experimenting with food, guys. Um, finding you know recipes and influences that you love. And Natasha Corbett um, from Honestly Healthy, I've been following, um, and she's influenced me for a couple of years. And and then I start making my own recipes from it and learning from that. That's like the most amazing way of how we can educate ourselves to uh, to live healthier and happier lives. And I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.